welcome back to my channel and if you are new here my name is Brenda so for today's video I'm gonna be giving you guys tips on how to create a cozy home especially right now that we are now hitting fall time I really wanted to incorporate something for you guys that just don't know where to start so hopefully these tips are very helpful for you guys and anyways we're gonna go ahead and get started if you are new here don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel it really really means the world and I can't believe you guys literally two weeks ago we were at like a hundred 90 subscribers and we're about to hit 400 that is insane and I really want to thank you guys so much for that but anyways we're gonna go ahead and get started with tips on how to make your home feel nice and cozy so tip number one is to consider your lighting lighting is everything you guys it can really make or break the mood of your house I definitely recommend that you guys have light bulbs that give off a warm glow in the areas where you guys like to wind down watch TV and just overall relax I personally have it in the living area in the dining room and then my kitchen I do have it a little bit different I have bright LED lights that's just personal preference I like to be bright and white in there and also down the hallway but in the areas where I like to relax you know feel cozy and all that I like to have warm lights and also on top of that candles are seriously a game changer if you guys don't have any candles and if you don't have any candles what are you doing where have you been candles seriously set the mood I like to turn on candles all over the house it just really like puts me in this nice relaxed mood and besides the fact that they smell amazing and you don't have to like spend a lot of money to get some really nice smelling candles you can find them at Walmart 99 cent store they're all over the place but definitely add candles if you want to feel cozy also another thing that can make a home feel very very nice and cozy is using the Sun when you have Sun coming in point the shades upwards and you will totally tell a difference on how nice and cozy it feels instead of just having like the Sun shine Shining in like hello how you doing um, you just point it towards the ceiling and then the lighting just gets you know the light gets spread all over the room so another big thing is also to remove clutter that is a no-brainer of course but when you have a cluttered home it really adds stress a really like huge tip when it comes to like feng shui is to have an uncluttered home there's a lot of people that like to say that cluttered surroundings add a cluttered mind when I don't feel like cleaning I will find a designated area where to place it until I have the energy to go and take everything out of there and organize it where it belongs take away clutter at least in the living areas where you like to relax like the bedroom the living room even the kitchen if you like to spend a lot of time in the kitchen um, that way when you're in that living area you don't feel stressed out because there's just so much stuff in there so this one I already mentioned but obviously light candles Lighting candles just set the mood, like I said, and it's just a huge game changer. My favorite type of candle is the three wick scented candles. Those are just the cutest. I love how it's just like, I don't know if it's the number three, that's very appealing to me, but I just love how they look. They are full and rounded, big enough to like add on my coffee table and just add that cozy feeling. It's I, I don't know what it is, but I feel like it's just more different than like the single wick ones. Pillows are also a huge thing. It just adds a sense of relaxation. Obviously, when let's say when you go to sleep, you love pillows. You see a pillow and you're like, oh man, I wanna go to sleep. And when you add pillows to your couches and whatnot, that just also adds that same type of feeling to it. I love pillows. Pillows are everything. And I just have them all over the place. I have so many thrown in my closet. Usually like I like changing up the style, the color. So I have tons in there that I like to switch up for you know, depending on the season, but definitely add pillows to your couch if you don't have any. Sometimes what I like to do as well is to add pillows onto like a little corner, like a little nook, and just make it feel nice and cozy. So throw blankets are also huge, you guys. If you don't have throw blankets thrown on your couch, what are you doing? <laughs> you have to put throw blankets on your couch. I used to fold the blanket and put it on the side of the couch, just like neatly fold it in three, but that really does not like make it feel cozy enough. When I used to work at the furniture store, I tend to just like grab the blanket, fluff it up and just throw it on there. Like you literally just got up the couch and you just left the blanket there. That's what you wanna add. So don't fold it, just like grab the blanket, grab the middle of it, scrunch into a little like triangle like this, fluff it up and then just throw it on the couch and it will look so cute. Another way to make your home feel cozy is to add music. The ambience is everything. So I love to play lo-fi. I love 
orchestra music, I love piano music, I just love all types of relaxing music. Lo-fi is probably my all-time favorite right now, so I love playing lo-fi around the house, that way it just feels relaxed. And depending on my mood as well, if I'm cooking, I'll play cooking music. If I'm relaxing, I'll just, you know, tell Alexa, hey, you know, play relaxing music. Another way to make your home feel cozy is to add textures. And that is going to be a separate video as well on how to decorate your home. But for this video, textures also can add a really nice cozy feeling to your house. If you have baskets, you have, you know, knitted stuff around the house, stuff that looks like it came out of literally, you know, outside, pieces of wood, a little basket with, you know, with firewood in it, like stuff like that really makes a space look way different and it just makes it feel like you are out in you know the forest in a cabin if you know what I mean so definitely add texture in your decor there's a different types of things depending on your your style and how you like to decorate your house so you can add cotton um, there's a lot of you know different things that you can do but definitely add different textures don't have just one single type of thing linen is also a type of fabric that feels super cozy and relaxing I love linen but um, anyways yeah definitely add textures into your decor another thing that you can do is also to simplify your color palette if you have one single color palette for the big pieces of furniture that you have then you can change it up with all of the accents and you can do whatever color you want so for me I have white couches white cabinets I have nice beige color curtains and then with that if I would let's say want to do Christmas I can add reds all over the house I can add greens I can add blues I can do whatever color because it's gonna match that obviously if you don't have like furniture like this you're not just gonna get up and throw your couch outside but um, you could get a couch cover that's a huge alternative to just cover your couches with a nice neutral color and then that way you can completely change your living space by adding different colors and then last but not least always be positive and your attitude is everything if you are upset if you're angry then your house is also gonna feel upset and angry do something for your well-being you can meditate you can watch a TV episode you can I don't know watch Tiger King I never watched it I don't know what the trend was about <laughs> but uh, you know do something that makes you happy and I just feel like vibes are everything um, obviously I'm not really crazy about all that stuff but vibes are everything and if you're giving off bad vibes your house is gonna take it in one thing that i love doing to make my house feel re-energized and stuff is to burn sage i love sage my husband hates the smell of it everyone in this house hates the smell of it but i just feel like it really re-energizes the house and it you know removes any bad energies that are coming through here but anyways that's gonna be it for this video you guys i really hope that you enjoyed and i am so excited to be sharing my updated fall home tour very very soon you guys have no idea how different this house looks and oh my god i'm just so excited this is why i've been you know kind of absent off youtube don't worry i'm not gonna stop uploading videos but i've just been working so hard on redecorating re 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 renovating what am i saying <laughs> redecorating and renovating my house and guys it's gonna look amazing i am so excited i hope you guys have a wonderful day and i will see you guys in the next video bye guys